in a hazy glow. My hands go wrong. This is my outfit for the day. I'm literally just gonna be inside all day, so, well, until I have to go to work. So, very, very basic. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. It's like, actually it's noon now, so. It's not really the morning time anymore, but it's my morning routine, so. Well, I'm just working on my skincare now. I already washed my face in the shower and like brushed my teeth and stuff already. I just downloaded Fruit Ninja again <laughs> because I was in the app store and um, it came up on my recommended list. And then it brought back some great memories of playing Fruit Ninja and all those other games like Subway Surfer and Temple Run in like eighth grade. My eighth grade, I think that's when they were popular. Those were so much fun. <laughs> so I'm just reliving the good old days. You know what I mean? I feel like I've showed you guys my skincare routine at least 2 million times now. So I'm just going to go ahead and not explain anything that I'm doing. Today's going to be a pretty chill day. I don't work until 7 p.m. 7.30 p.m. So yeah, I'm just going to work on my miniature um clothing collection that i'm literally only creating so that i can film a youtube video and take some cool pictures if you're not extra what's the point you know me making excuses because i'm so extra for no reason my new skincare routine has been really just changing my life my skin feels good it's healthy it's thriving it's like partially because I'm not in school and overly stressed out every single day anymore. And partially because I started washing my face two times a day. And I always kind of thought that was like a myth that it didn't really change your skin or affect your skin that much. But now that I've actually started doing it, I've noticed the biggest difference in my skin for all you out there like me who thought who think that washing your face two times a day will probably do nothing, um, just go ahead and give it a try for like a week. And I guarantee that you will see at least some results in your skin. But if you don't, um, don't blame me. <laughs> blame your skin and try and find something that works for you. But I'm sure that washing your face twice a day will not hurt anything and it will definitely most likely help your skin out. Also, I've been doing my hair in this like, I mean, it's not done right now, but this is essentially what it looks like when it is done. So might as well just go out like this. Anyways, I've been doing my hair just in a low bun every day and it's just so easy, but I really need to venture out and like try some new hairstyles because my hair is free right now. It is not braided. I can do anything that I want with it and 
I have just chosen to do the most boring basic thing that I could think of. But doing your hair is just so much work. I don't know how people do their hair every day because I just really cannot, which is one of the main reasons that I get my hair braided because I'm the laziest person on this earth. When it comes to hair, I stopped using this moisturizer. Where is the thing? I stopped using this moisturizer because it was way too thick for my skin and it just felt greasy and oily and nasty after a while. Like I had to use it for a while to realize that I don't really like it that much on my skin. But it works really well for like my decolletage or whatever this is called. <laughs> just my neck area um, because it is thick so i could like use this on my arms or something but i guess it would work well for someone with really dry skin i feel like people with dry skin really like thick and heavy creams but i have oily skin so i don't like that at all even like putting on sunscreen i'm kind of eh about because it is a little bit greasy just because it's sunscreen and sunscreen is like that but I will still always wear this because I am not trying to have my black crack. I do not want wrinkles and I want these acne scars to go away as quickly as possible and not get any darker. Today, before I go to work, today my plans are just going to be um, finishing my clothes that I'm making and then eating lunch and dinner. <laughs> That's basically all I'm doing today. I might, might go to the mall with my dad, but um, that's kind of unlikely to happen because he's doing things all day today. And um, yeah, that's, that's the only reason he's just busy today. But I'm busy tomorrow on Thursday, which is the day that I told him that I could go to the mall with him because I forgot that I had things to do on Thursday. So he planned for us to go to the mall on Thursday to film this video. But um, yeah, so we'll see how that works for me. Now to put on my makeup for no reason because I'm not even leaving the house today, but I figured I might as well show you all my makeup in this morning routine because I often do wear a little bit of makeup when I'm actually doing things during the day. So if this is going to be an accurate morning routine, got to do what I normally do. You know what I'm saying? That is a fluffy brow right there, honey. <laughs> I felt like um, Kendall Jenner in her Vogue video with my hair like this because this is literally what her hair looks like. She just like swooped it up into a little bun thing. Hers looked better because her hair looked actually brushed, unlike mine. Mine is definitely not brushed, but we haven't started on our hair yet, so everything's gonna be fine. You know when you're so focused on something that you like stop breathing for some reason? That's me while I'm doing all of my makeup. So you can catch me suffocating. Uh, two of the three products down. Now just one more. My Q&A that I posted last week was 20 minutes long. I did not expect it to be that long. So shout out to you if you watched that whole thing without skipping any of it because you are a real one. Thank you. <laughs> I love that for me. You no, know, it would be so helpful if I was ambidextrous and I could just switch hands when I'm doing my mascara. So that would never be a problem. Also, how does a person's body figure out which hand is comfortable to do things with for the rest of their life? You know, like why am I right handed? Why didn't my brain just choose my left hand so that I could, you know, you know, or like, why not both? Why are there only very few people who are ambidextrous? Why can't we just teach our children how to write with both hands? So that life is just so much easier. You could draw with both hands. You know, if one gets cramped up, 
or something or when you're doing your makeup it would just be so much easier to put on mascara because you wouldn't have this problem of getting mascara on your nose not that that is like world ending problem but being ambidextrous would just be awesome for everyone well i am basically all ready for my day and i'm just gonna work on my clothes now so and i'll probably put on some chapstick but that's about it that is my morning routine if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe if you're new here so that you can see more videos from me because i do a lot of videos kind of like this um, i do a lot of runway behind the scene videos if you like those go check those out on my channel um, they're pretty fun to see and fun to film <laughs> make sure to follow me on instagram too so that you can be updated about when i'm filming and like when i'm gonna be posting and stuff like that and to just get more of my life <laughs> just to see more of my life hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next week